Yeah, I think that after this is over and, and the fireplace is gone, the community can heal and we can move forward and take care of problems, other problems we have. Shirley Gibson is one of the three newly elected Charlevoix City Council members. She believes the residents in her ward do not want a downtown fireplace. And tonight, she and the two other new council members plan on making a motion to end the project. I mean, we have to decide, are we going to tear out all of it, leave the base and do something with that? Or what are we going to do? To completely get rid of the fireplace, council has to make and approve three motions to suspend the project, reconsider it, and rescind it. If there is a two-thirds vote on all three, then the project will come to an end. I really can't predict the future, but uh, I think uh, the future of the fireplace, though, is dim, and uh, we'll, we'll see what happens in the future here. Even though many of the council members believe the project will likely be suspended, some would still like to set up a hearing to see what the public wants to do with the space near East Park. We should listen to what they want with that area. I personally would like to see nothing there. It's a gateway to the park and the marina. I'd like to keep it open. Despite the constant uproar over the project, some would like to see the city move forward with the fireplace. It's been a lot of discussion over the last eight or nine months, and I, and I think it's probably gonna, um, it's gonna end tonight. Uh, I'm disappointed that that's gonna happen. Um, I don't think talking about it anymore is gonna fix anything. Um, I just would like that the council to consider what's best for our community.